Welcome back to Philly Live. We love giving you access to the people, places, and experiences throughout the Philadelphia region. And I recently got the chance to catch up with a two-time Grammy winner, Corinne Bailey Ray, who is inspiring young people in our area to pursue their dreams and ambitions. Three little birds, girl, put your records on. Tell me your favorite song. You need to know, let your head down. These music students weren't the only hearts captured by the British Grammy winner when she hopped on the scene in 2006. I never really dreamed that I would be accepted into this culture. You know, I was like, well, they have all their own amazing music. Why would they be interested in, in what we do? So when we're here and someone's singing like, go ahead, go Yeah, we're welcoming you yeah. with open arms. Fans lined the block to see the soul singer take the stage at Union Transfer in Callow Hill. I just think in general playing in America is such a thrill for us because so much of our music is influenced by, you know, African American music and soul music. It's so interesting because you write your music and you produce your music. What is that like? What's the process of creating the perfect song? I love writing and I love being away from people and I love the process of, you know, spinning the wheel. And, and in her spare time, she's giving back to music hopefuls. Corinne teamed up with the Grammy Music Education Coalition for a Q&A with local students. So music education has been so important for me and just having people who believe. What we're doing in the coalition is to expand music participation. So we're helping to train teachers. We have 70 affiliate partners like Little Kids Rock, like VH1 Save the Music Foundation. I love my school's music program. It's very like enriching and just like very fun because you can be creative and it's like an open space. And being there, it really opened me up as an artist and taught me a lot and definitely pushed me too. Why was it so important for you to share your music journey with them? And that is how I got my start in music through school and having teachers who believed in me. And I think every child should have access to music. And I think it's really different now for young people. You could be in your bedroom anywhere in the world. And, you know, the internet has opened up so much for young people. And, and with first-hand advice from the songstress herself, this should be a journey these young people never forget. She's just a sweetheart, and I appreciated her sharing her time, just talking to us, just being really carefree. Wow, I love this. That's what the arts is all about. The Grammy Music Education Coalition pledged to donate $5 million to the School District of Philadelphia. The investment will be used to develop music curriculum for all grades. For more details about the Grammy Music Education Coalition, look for the Philly Live section of NBC10.com or the NBC10 app.